Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gon' talk, we gon' have fun. We be on fire, we be lit lit. It's a unique hustle, big, big, Check, check, check it. It's a unique hustle. It's your boy ECO, and I'm here with the lovely, amazing, official Mr. Jamaica. What's going on? Nothing, nothing. You know, my dad, well, go on. I want y'all to stop what you're doing right now. Go like, subscribe, follow us on all social media platforms. I mean, our Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, Facebook, threads, you name it, we're on it. But if you want to see our um, visuals, you definitely have to go to our YouTube channel. There we'll put all our exclusive content that you can't find anywhere on our membership section. So y'all say you love us. Y'all say that you want to support us. Yes, it's great to buy our merch and stuff. But let me tell you, you got to support us by going ahead and subscribing. Not only subscribing, but purchasing our membership on our YouTube channel. How you do so is click under the description under this video and any video that we have click the link and it will take you to the section to go ahead and be a member on our show thank you very much man it's going down man hey man we got a special guest in here today man this guy don't need no introduction man this guy is a guru when it comes to interviewing you guys go are in for a treat he here today yeah man and, and he ain't dude. playing no games. HSM little dude is in the building. Yeah, what is it? You see how I come in there? You yeah, like, I damn. <laughs> <laughs> that yeah, nigga yeah, did yeah. that. Man, That's how really, you doing, man? Man, I'm doing good, man. Man, I wanted to get you on the show, man, just because of you just the uh, history, the music history, the Dallas, just mm -hmm. the whole Dallas wave, man. I know you, you know what I'm saying? You seen everything that was going down in the city. You've been around. So we want to just, you sure. know, just do a little bit of a history, uh, a history check with you and just, also, uh, you know, just you know, just some of the stuff that you've been through. You know what I'm yeah. saying, man. So, so you're born What's and raised up? here in Dallas. Yeah, uh, I was born in McKinney. It's a little town right outside here, but South 13, 14. You born I'm in McKin McKinney? Yeah, yeah, yeah McKinney, yeah, Texas. Family. Mm -hmm. That's hard, man. Yeah. So, HSC, man. Who is that? Is that Mo three on your neck? Yeah, three. That's hard, man. Uh -huh. I, I ain't seen that. I one. ain't seen a yeah. necklace like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's hard, man. I've been in North Dallas, though, so I'm about 13, 14 years old. Though. Wow. Oh, okay. I'm going to be 27. Mm -hmm. going to be 27? Yeah, that's where it started going down. You're young, man. Mm -hmm. I'm old, nigga. You, you better be enjoying that. Yeah, right. You enjoy that 27. Right. It's going to pass by fast. Whew. <laughs> Let's talk about so it. So were you raised with your mom and dad in the same household? Oh, no. My dad I was been locked up. My mom, she kind of a little younger than him, but nah, my, my mom and my granny. Mm. Until like when I moved out there, that's when my mama started. She got she had on she was on her own stuff then, you know. How old was your mama when she had you? Oh, I think about sixteen seventeen. Oh, okay. Yeah, 17, and you say your daddy always been locked up? Nah, let me see. I'm twenty six I'm I'm twenty six. Uh he probably been locked up like like probably sixteen years though. So how old were you? Yeah, how yeah. old were you when he first went? Uh, it's a picture, so I think when I first about a little bit after I came out, I think he was locked up and then went for like three, four years at that time I came out. So do you remember any time spending time with him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every time he got out, my dad, man, I done went to everything in the world. I done went to SeaWorld, all types, I done had everything. So you had memories, you have jail, memories with him. He took care of us. Oh, know? okay, okay. I got one of them pops. Oh, okay, he always made sure he did what he was supposed yeah. to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it wasn't just like probably. Let me say, let me say this. Probably fourteen to probably fourteen years, and it mm -hmm. was like probably three, and then out for three, and then in for five. You know. But as a kid, which which one meant more to you? Did it mean more to you that he sent in the money for y'all to go Sea World and do all this other stuff, now, or we, for him being we, right? Every time we got out, like we did stuff like that. As soon as he got out, oh, as soon as he got out, he took you. Yeah, okay. but probably while he was locked up, he was still buying stuff and shit. Like, yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, that's good though. I had good, one, of them, that's I had good. one of them, you know. Yeah, was him and your mama still together even uh, although she wasn't holding him down? Oh, they probably never was together. <laughs> yeah. Just stories from you know hearing about my daddy. He was up, you know, he he was up there though. Wow. Oh, okay. I, I gotta, I gotta, uh, we gotta get into it, man. Like you, you and Mo Three. How old was you when you in? I see you wearing the Mo Three necklace, and I know that mean a lot to you. Like, how old were you when you first met Mo Three? She probably what? <laughs> yes, for real. Cousin. Yeah, yeah, first cousin? cousin? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not first, but we cousins though, right? Wow. Yeah, hey, yeah. When did his you? Mama is like that's like my mama. Nicole, like my mama. What, I, when I did you know that you, that that he was talented? That he was different? Shit. 
I don't know. Probably when we was little, he always could sing and rap. That's what Cole Gotti said. He Same thing. He always could. And my brother too. And like three, four. Uh, yes. Yeah, probably soon as you can, like, you I can realize. Yeah, yeah. Damn. Who is older? Good. You older than him? Nah, I'm twenty. He, nah, he, young, he younger. younger than both. He of younger than both of them. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm twenty six, three thirty one. Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. Yeah. So yeah. you basically yeah. seen it, you just you seen them just basically, uh, you seen him and you like man he's a dude different. Yeah, like man, like with everything, like he was bad. Like I always hung out with like older people too, probably because of him. You know they moved to Dallas way before me too. You know I'm I'm five, he got me by five years and they went out there since he was like thirteen. Do you think that but, when he when he came to Dallas he went through a lot? You know they I heard about him sleeping. Still, yeah, he was I, sleeping on the in yeah. front of apartments you know, all kind of mama, stuff. So I'm still gonna find my way to you know her has every yeah so, you know soon yeah. Like yeah. I think it was, my mama ended up moving out there too. I want to say like mm-hmm. Cole Gotti was saying he you know he would. Be getting, you know, he get out, he might be on the run, or you know, anything, you know. He Man, just that nigga done ran away. He was bad. He was bad. Right. <laughs> that nigga thug. That nigga was flipping, that and some big bad. fat nigga flipping. You heard? Yeah, he wasn't always fat though. No, nah, yeah. but he was flipping. Yeah, wasn't yeah, yeah. I, that first, I remember that first he video. Was, he wasn't fat. Man, that nigga probably could flip off the table. He liked hmm. to flip. <laughs> For real. Did you used to do stuff like that too? Yeah, I flip too, but not like not off the table. <laughs> not <laughs> like, like him. Yeah, do that. Yeah. Everything, man. He was always the best. Uh, everything. He yeah, inspired you a lot? With his age, yeah. Hey, yeah, man. Like every everywhere he went, I went. Like everybody tell you, like, like if I'm out of jail these last, you know, couple years and shit, I'm right there. Like ever since I was little, I was right there with What was it about him that inspired you, that made you want to follow him? Because probably because he was always a leader. You know, like, he he always stood out, you know, for sure. Like, I always had the girls. You know, he can sing, you know. He, he, ain't always, he, them, he ain't always been ugly as he was. You know, <laughs> he got fat. <laughs> you know, he can sing, you know. He, Everything, man. He never backed down to no situation, man. He always was, you know, some of the times you see him, you just always seem to be on go. Like, he wasn't yeah, trying sure. to hear, you know. Yeah, he was living like that for He was living, yeah, and that's the, that's the part. Being like that. Because his talent was equating so big to where you would you would want to, like, man, just just enjoy the success. You know what I mean? Yeah. But he was so so caught up in his life. He was street like Man, but, but when he first jumped out, like, when people was hating and stuff like that, just cause all that he done been through, like I used to hear him talking about, he was letting a lot of, you know, he just let a lot of stuff. He let make a lot it. of it go. Yeah, let it go. Thinking about that, like man, I don't want to do that no more. Yeah, you know, I kept going to jail. And shit, they ended up bringing this shit out. Wow, <laughs> for real. Let me ask you this: like, like, like when, um, what was the first song that when you heard it, you like that whole gonna go crazy? Oh, man, you ain't talking about when we was little, right? You talking about... You talking about taking the church and all that. Oh, uh, probably hold your tongue. That's the one you knew it. You was there that day? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was there when he went when we went downtown. The, uh, the fire truck dude, what's that nigga name? Oh, I forgot. But and I then y'all was, y'all was... Wasn't y'all in the North, too? Y'all was, I thought y'all was in the North. When? when y'all wasn't in the, the, y'all didn't do that in the North? Nah, we went. I downtown. always in my mind because of the north and the when connection. We the video, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's I what I thought. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm yeah. talking about when he recorded it. Oh, when he recorded yeah, when it. We was when we was did the video. We was in the middle four line. He did, but Rain was was Rain with him. Yeah. Rain probably came probably like after that. Probably like nine months after that though. Okay, so I okay. remember like I remember when he came around like first time I went to jail. I didn't go to the pen yet, but I was. I had just turned 17, and when we did that, it was probably like six months before I turned 17 when Hold Your Tongue came out. Or, well, like probably seven, eight months before. Wow. What did you, when you say you went to prison like the first time, what did you bump your head? What happened? Oh, uh, all right. So, first time when I'm seeing them when I was 17, uh, I was doing some bullshit, burglaries and shit like that. Yeah. So, that's how I'm saying I remember because I had got, when I, I had got stabbed. Right? Okay. It was doing some bullshit. Somebody stabbed you in the head. You got stabbed. Yeah, in my head, my arm, shit. Like that, in my hands. Damn, boy. Tripping, but. But you were young. Yeah, I was young. But I called through and told him to come get me. I was hiding because the police were chasing me. I left, you know. And he he had left from we rain them downtown. They came to get me. That's when they met him. Like, we had probably met him probably a couple weeks, probably a month or two before that. So you got away that time? 
Yeah, but I, I didn't because I, I started bleeding too much and I ran. I was about so to I say had, you had to go to the hospital. Yeah, I had to go to the hospital. So and they caught you by there. Time, by the time three got there, all the police and shit was coming there too. And like, we still talk about that day. Like, Raina bring that up. You remember when you got that? You know, that was when I was 17. 17. You almost died if you're losing that much blood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My hand and everything. I barely feel my hand. I was tripping. One Boy, thing I can't understand when people come to s- s- near death situations like that, you would think that a lot of people would want that. Change their life and be like, oh, I ain't even gonna mess with this stuff no more because, right. you know. Wow. Do you, what was your state of mind after that? Uh, uh, you know, like anyway, you know, I like I told you three of them older than me, so doing it like he like, bro, that's some crackhead shit. Why you doing it to me? Right. Shit? Anyway, but you know, I'm seventeen. Man. You younger than them, even like yeah, they five six. When yeah. they was getting into it, like right. with trap, and they was having a and when they first, how did that even all See, become now, an issue? I was ever you since, were young, right? Now, when when him and Traps first started, they was, I, I went to count it in, right? Didn't they have a song or something? They was yeah, like, I was there with all that. What though. was that all about, though? I didn't ever hear no, the just just of it right. from 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 your your all point right, of so, view. Um, you know, I can't talk about it a lot. Yeah. When I got out, I I went to, like at that time I went to county. I got out and then I went to the pen. And then when I got out, boom. Right, right before I went to, to the pen, we was they was cool. We had all got cool. Y'all was all y'all was all, all, all cool. You know what I'm saying? Like that three my best friend. Like I'm we growing now, you know, I'm probably like at that time I'm probably twenty. You know, twenty one. He like, you know, twenty six. But yeah, like, I know Fred and them too. But um I it was already a little stuff going on before I got out. So by the time I got out, he wasn't talking to them. Oh. You know what I'm saying? He wasn't talking to them. So we at the barbershop one time on uh saying, you know, it's raps. You know the shop he yeah, was talking yeah, about. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, so uh, we in there eating, Sean cooking. You know, Sean G, he in there. Yeah, that's it. That's the bodyguard. Like, I just got out too, probably like a month or two before this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He'd get mad if you say that. I used to call him bodyguard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> All right, but uh, Freddie come in there and try to shake, shake bro hand, you know? Like, it's a, doing, this, doing this month or two, this, I've been out, like, I see both of them calling the nigga phone, trying to talk to him about something. He ain't talking about it. He ain't talking about it too much. All right, but since I've been out, Freddie come up there, try to shake his hand, and he ain't shaking his hand. He just kept eating his food. He like, damn, you don't fuck with me. You know the yayo and shit, and nah, all that shit had, you know, happened. So, uh, you know, through just like, nah, you know what I'm saying? So, a little bit after that, probably, probably the next day, I swear to God on my life, he did a video, uh interview with Sean Cotton. Like, if you would talk to him, he would remember me. Like, both of their videos, I was there. When he did his first video, they met each other in the hallway. I was there, but... And, but I was there this time too, and he asked three about the uh, song, about the six peak, you know what I'm talking about? So see, three was just, he just started laughing. You know, at this time, you know, he was already going down here and shit because he caught the case, but he just started laughing and shit. So uh, I really want to tell him, like, he ain't saying nothing. He trying to throw it off from shit we were just talking about, you know, earlier, but he trying to throw the shit off. He just started laughing. I know he didn't ask Sean what to ask him. You know, I'm sitting right there. I wanted him to say, Tell him about yesterday when it, he tried to shake your hand, you want to shake his hand. You know what I'm saying? So you know the next day, that's when Freddie make that video and was like, "Don't ask nobody about my song." You know what I'm saying? He really, you really are mad because day before you tried to shake your hand, his hand, he ain't shake your hand. You know what I'm saying? So when Sean asked him that, that was his way to come out. That, that happened right there. That was his way. To, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Wow. The show he was already hating anyway. That he was already finna go on the other why, side. Why anyway. was the why was it because of the sun? Why would I, couldn't they have worked it out? You don't think so? Um, at that point, yeah, probably so. But I ain't gonna lie. You know, I'm gonna keep it real, bro. Stubborn, but he be having reason. But he's stubborn. So when y'all done talking, he ain't really talking to you. Like you know, like he ain't tell he ain't, like with the six pick song. You know, he ain't tell nobody to pick no size or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? But he almost just lost his life behind, you know, this nigga you on this song with, you know, you know what I'm saying? Because some, you know, if you listen to the songs, you know what's going on, but some big stuff happened. So it was more to it than him just not getting Yeah, it was more song. to it than him. So you're going to keep talking, yeah, it's cool. I'm just, I'm not telling you not talking about it. I'm just not going to fuck with you. Wow. Why would you fuck with you and you fuck with people that, you know, they did some snake stuff. Yeah, I mean, um, at, at that time, though, you know, to keep, because that was a big part of the whole situation. Mm-hmm. You know me being a, a a person who would want to make a bridge. If you watch Boss Talk, you'll know that. Yeah. Like it's like you would rather see. You know, I would rather see everybody. You know, here. You know what I'm saying? Right. I mean, even right. to keep I it on you. wax. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. If everything could have been just caught, just kept on wax instead mm-hmm. of 
taking it the extra mile, then maybe things could have been better. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I know how niggas is. We gonna get it off. I lost a lot of homeboys yeah. when I was young. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I understand. And certain bridges you can't go back over once you once once you burn bridges, it's, it's done. You know? Yeah, right. And then it's a lot of stuff that happened between that time, like people going out and this nigga trying to stun in front of Junior and MJ Prince. And they're like, like he was doing too much. Like he was. I ain't gonna lie. Like you can say he was, he was picking. You know, like you know about bro, but you like you doing too much, bro. Like he made him snap. I <laughs> like so that, back you couldn't go back. Snap. You keep going, you gonna get what you want, you know, type of thing. How you thinking, you know? Wow. And so, I mean, you being his cousin though, and with everything that happened and transpired, where were you at when you when he when he got killed on the highway? Were you I out? No, I had went back to the pen. So what did you when you heard that? I know it must have crushed you. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? At that time, I was out for two years. Then I went back for two years. Now I've been out for almost two years. But when you heard that, yeah, that shit was crazy. How was that day? Uh, we was on. You know, it was the fucking what unit? Corona shit. I was on foreign B. I was still on transfer okay, unit okay, this time. Okay, I only had two years, so it wasn't no reason for that. Yeah, it's turn around. That's yeah, a turn around. Yeah. So, uh, man, yeah, it was Corona. So you know, we bre- we only got like 15 minute calls a day, like one call, and I just happened to, you know. Uh, call one of my partners and they tell me, they tell me, yeah, he's laying on the street. They talk. Somebody keeps saying, I'm talking, I'm talking to this girl. She keeps saying, mm, mm, mm. For somebody we talking about, um, first thing to hit me is three, cause you, she know I don't really, like, brother, like I'm young, but that's my everybody know that's my best friend. Like, what, like the video you were talking about on YouTube, we at the shop. I'm right there. Like, yeah. Me and him, we called Sean. He we'll already there. It. Come on, Sean. We finna knock on the door. That video went, went crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fred, he know me. <laughs> I wish they could have. I pushed him. I w- you, you was in that video that yeah, day. Yeah, I swear to God. I mean. Yeah, I pushed him on the door. I wish it could have just been a fight or something, man. Right. And everything could have been over. You know what I mean? He tried, though. He kept telling him, come on. That's what we came for. Just from. fight and get it out yeah, the way. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, some, just say, like, we knocked on your door. Like. In this shopping center right here, you know we come in the fight. Like, come on, yeah, mo, you think about that. But who finna do some? Like, you think we finna come all the way over, knock on your door, and try to shoot you? And everybody tell or something, you know? Like, nah, ain't not a fight. You so know, y'all we went came, over there to fight that day. Yeah, 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 fight. Come on. Don't you think? If we on camera, like it's it's a shopping center. Don't you wish it could have just been a fight that day, so everybody could have just got it off I their chest? I tried to fight too. I tried to fight his brother. We tried. <laughs> so deep, uh, you would have rather daddy. just had a fight and then let it, you know, just let it all go. Right. You, just get it off your chest. You know right. what I mean? You see how I threw that over, we think, you know, he could have looked over there. He just, yeah. Yeah. I'm mad about him not shaking your hand. Yeah. I, I just wish, like yeah, I said, exactly. my thing is. We that would have been better. That would have been better just to get a scrap on, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And, and that's the way we did it. I mean, don't get me wrong. Some people got killed when I was younger, too. But, um just a scrap man sometime and, and walking away, everybody could still be. You know how crazy it'd be in the city right now? Right. It'd be up, but. It'd right. be crazy, man. We tried, though. Yeah. You see, yeah. You, like I'm saying, you always doing too much. You come do that, you come out here like, like I said, it's a shopping center, bro. You know you're not finna do nothing anyway. Why is you coming out here? We Everybody got feelings. Why is you coming out here with the big old, you know what I'm saying? On the video. Why is you coming outside like this? Like, nigga, I wanna hit you, though, and it go off. But you're not finna do nothing. Just come on. Yeah, well, I'm just, like I said, man, I, I, I sit back and listen to the music and all the movement, man, and it's like, damn, you know, like, man, that's a hard pill to swallow because now, you know, he's still, we got some music, but it ain't it ain't, yeah. it ain't, ain't on the level like, you know, like right. like three would have did it if he were right. here. You know what I'm saying? Right, really sure. I But, but what, I what about um, your T-Rail? He always, he sing Mo three songs at yeah. the at his deal. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. He always show homage when he come on this show. Yeah, what's up? He always do, bro. Like, I don't we, think he really remember me like that, but a couple shows I've been to, I was out. You though, seen I him? Remember, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's hard. But man. you know, we ain't talking to, they, they talk to each other a little bit. Yeah, he, of course, yeah, they probably. I'm not, yeah. You're not, right. the, you're not the one who, right. so did, were, were you out any of the time when he did the boost? you went out with the Boosie Meats? Man, nah, look, right before, Right, right. Time I the whole time the damn near two years I was out probably like three, like probably four five months before I went back is when him and Boosie started talking again. Like they weren't talking. 
Oh, they had fell out. Yeah, yeah, I don't know if they fell out. But I they remember that because they were going. He was yeah. going to sign to him, and then he didn't. Yeah, yeah he, they weren't talking about until right before I went back. Was it you? Th I wonder if it was because he he ended up signing with Empire. Now, that was way later. That was way later when the Empire came. Like well, him and Boosie happened. I was still in the prison. You know, I went I went to jail three times. Went to prison the last two times. But I was yeah. still. I was just getting out the. You know, first time when him and Boosie was fucking around. By the time I went back, I heard that he didn't sign to Empire. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's crazy, man. And he you, was going downhill, bro. Like, man, they were trying to blackball him. Did you ever did you ever think that that he would have like made made all that happen like that? When y'all was kids? Right. Like yeah, ten, yeah, you yeah, know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah, hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. You could see it I, happening? I knew, yeah, hey, yeah. It was just something but, different. I, but at that time right there though, like, like when he start going down here and everybody trying to hold their nuts on him and stuff, it start. I ain't gonna lie though, I start thinking like I don't know why, because he was his talent was gonna exceed that. Right. I just, I guess I didn't know. Cause you we didn't know. Didn't the show, yeah. And then I see how people really scared to let him perform and stuff like that. I'm like, damn. You know, yeah, I know why, but damn they gonna be like that it, it got, got real, real intense i'm hearing not, some dude this fat dude on 97.9 him you know they was him and somebody got a tool or something he telling my nigga we done with this mo3 stuff you know it was a show he had with r kelly we was at a college or something oh, okay you know what I'm saying? he telling me this I'm like, damn you know like, what you do <laughs> the money you like you think about the career and the money yeah, huh i'm like damn they, yeah like they blackball people i'm thinking they gave man black my ball is kept real. Going. like i even dropped a couple videos on this channel when i was out like like it's his channel you know if, like i should drop back 23 20 videos i dropped like two videos i'm like man i don't know so I know you he still can doing do music yeah 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 you talking about me yeah 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 what you got? You got new videos out? Yeah, I got a. I man, got a was Mo three the reason why you got into music? Um, yeah, you know, I always, you know, we, him from him rapping and us freestyling, and that's how it started. Yeah, that's how it came. Mm -hmm. But you know, say when I was at that time, you know, I probably dropped two videos on his channel. I'm out for two years. Why did not drop twenty videos? Mm -hmm. Twenty, thirty videos in two years. You know, but so I was going with him to all the shows. And, my nigga kept going. By the time I went back, man, he went up. Like, messed you up, up, didn't it? Man, messed me up. I don't give up. I ain't never say that to, you know. Like, like, like what I was telling you earlier, shit, about the, uh, like, when he, by the time the booster shit came, I think he started feeling as if he had too much money. Like, mm -hmm. what, you know what I was saying earlier? Like, like one time we in the studio, like, after his whole tape was done, you know, we in there listening to Rain tell him, like, no, bro, that shit, that ain't it. You know, I never heard nobody tell him nothing like this, right? But he messed laughed. you up, didn't? He? Yeah, but it messed me up. But he laughing because he know, like, who gonna tell him this? You know what I'm saying? Like, nah, I know this ain't like he he talking about money and have. He got to talk about the pain. What you do? You know what I'm saying? Like that shit work. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like he knew. Like he he he. We be laughing like, yeah, I had too much money making this out. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, I'll trip that. So he, <laughs> he laughed, he laughed, but he know what he finna drop. And back the mother bitches come, you know. He went hard and hard every time, yeah, didn't he? Yeah, really shit. When y'all did, uh, yeah, see, yeah, when you, nine times ten. Yeah, you see that? That's when I hard, that bro. Time. I should've, I should've, I should've yeah, yeah, You yeah, should've yeah. kept going. I should hear me. But uh, they doing all this shit. I ain't know. I'm like, man. But you know, now I'm going, I done drop, you know, some more. You going in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I done dropped a song called Bad Habits. Lottery, me and Kogata got a song. A song at them hoes. But and then you know I just went fam I just went viral two times on Famous Animal. You so I, no, yeah, yeah, he yeah. been on here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I went viral on that last time. Me you went down to Memphis or he or he came up here? Uh, nah, he came he came up here one both yeah, times. Yeah, Bobby a beast man. That's my boy. Yeah, he, you know, he just went viral on that song. He I come on that. here and cut up on here, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah my name. So you yeah, just yeah. you you be enjoying it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I so what do you feel like you feel like what what's gonna be different this time? You got to do it by yourself. Mo ain't here no more. Right. Right, right. You know, bro, be pushing me. You know, Ryan be pushing the nigga. But that's oh, of course, I that's need. what he do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, and it, it seemed like y'all was y'all was busting y'all. But you and you and Mo Three was doing a lot of music together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you stopped. Ain't just to do not a time, time. I And stopped. you stopped because I, I went back to jail. <laughs> I went back to jail. 
But you know, I, I could should have been dropping. I probably would have dropped more. But you know, I went back to jail, and then when I'm in there, he started going in. That's when, if you look at the long time coming video, yeah, you know, I probably was in jail probably months after that. I'm right there, man. Right it's there cr it's so. crazy that you that you basically you seen everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, you I'm right there. there with Mo, and and right the there. crazy part is, and why Ryan fought me like that? He knows, yeah, like, like I'm always a, if if you could talk to Mo, and right now, what would you say? Man, shit, you right about everything. Then you keep going. They gotta keep going. You know, don't never give up. Like it's a lot of time. Like is I'm that telling, what he you told know, you? I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want a lot of time. I want listening to him. You know, I'm bad. He yeah. said you could do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Like everybody, he tell people that. What do you do? What's your process? Like you, that shit right there. I ain't pay for that. They pay for that shit. When you go to the to the studio now, um, you remember working with him, like what's your process when you do your music? Um, sometimes I ain't gonna lie, sometimes people see me beats how I go and make a course or something, but it ain't nothing like when you get to that yo and you in that zone. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's it. But shit, you know, still while I'm chilling or something like that, listen to beats, I can always make a verse. And you can always put a verse you made on something and to any beat, you know. Or well, to a lot of beats, most beats, you know. I just switched up a little bit. But yeah, that's how I do this. Man, I, th I think the main thing is, like, now that everything everything's transpired and you having to, you know, just try to keep the legacy alive. Are you drop? Where are you dropping your music at now on YouTube? Is it still on the HSM channel? Oh uh, yeah, we the, the song me and Bumpy finna drop. I'm yeah, gonna try to see if we can put that on there. I think we finna put that on there. But who, who's who's controlling others, that channel now? Uh, I don't I don't know, but I'm gonna just tell him and whoever tell he got to talk to. Yeah, you know. So you because you still pushing the, the HSM movement? Yeah, hey, yeah, that's 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 family. You know the other peoples and shit like that. That's you know, pro little boy, he done signed. I ain't got no problem with him. I yeah. think they wish, them, you know. But this, like, we really started this from nothing. Like, for real. Yeah, yeah. I got it. I got big ass HSM on my knee. We got that together when I was there. I got HSM four times on my face. For real, you just look. You, yeah, 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 you had you four times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> What about when you, you went on Famous Animal TV, right? Yeah. And then you also went on Rap Economics. Mm-hmm. Um, what was the difference? On what was the What was the difference? Oh, you got you got these wait, two. Wait. These two are kind of similar. I didn't have right. both of them on my show. Right. I always mess with them. Like y'all niggas show kind of. What's right. the, the difference? Probably the only probably the only difference is with both famous animals. I already knew what song I was finna do. You know when I got up in there, like on IG. You know they both went up, but I already knew what song. Probably one of my best songs first came. Started with you know the one I did on Famous Animal first. The one with uh that one, it's about the same, but you know I just, I don't, you know, I, like I just ain't know I ain't know I was gonna like, go, so I, I was like, like man, what song I'm gonna do? Yeah, you know, but you, I think they both. I love cool. famous. I'm gonna say yes, go. That right. nigga, they be in there turned up. On, and yeah, then, yeah, yeah. Then my boy, my boy, they my boy, friend up. say everybody can't come over here. Them niggas yeah, be yeah, going yeah. here, man. Like they both dope, man. I, that's why I rock. Like, like he and Memphis, famous animal, and then. Uh, them boys in Texas, yeah, so yeah. you know already. I gotta rock with them, the uh, rap economic niggas, man. It's going down, and they, like right. I said, they they working their butt off, both of them. And I love what they doing for the culture. And they both cool. In the they both cool. They both helping the culture. They're genuine, genuine. Both, both, both of them. them. Genuine yeah. as hell, trying to make sure they push the culture, man. Mm -hmm. So I mean, you know, out of everything that went on, what do you? I know you regret losing Mo three the most. Mm -hmm. Like what do you what what when you look back at what you done and what you could have done different? Is there anything that yeah, you would have liked yeah, yeah. to have done? The whole time when we, he was going down here and I just got out, I should have still been dropping like he's saying. You know, yeah. I'm just making my money and you know going to the shows. I should have been dropping, dropping, dropping because this shit paid off. I think that's that's. I should have just been kept dropping. dropping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it would have been. Yeah, yeah, but it would have been all the way up. Yeah, now. It would have been all the way up. I would have been reaching help by by now. It don't matter though. What God have for you, brother? It's coming to you, man. You know that. Mm -hmm. Ain't nothing you can do to get away from what God have for you. Always yeah. remember that, man. Square business. So you ain't got to worry about nothing, man. And, and 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 look like you out of everything and everybody, you got the most music with Mo Three. Yeah, 
Yeah, yeah. You, you see, think about- if I can get my old phone I had if I was there, it was way more. Like it I had way get, more? Yeah, the one I dropped with us while I was out. I mean, the last one, it's another one called, uh, I knew it, that we were supposed to been shot the video too. I'm steady bullshitting. But you got the song or you don't? Yeah, it's on YouTube now. It's yeah. called, it's with me and three called, you knew it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why you just didn't dry, do it, just it and, and you just dropped it? I just dropped it. Did you do a video it. too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and his part on that, but he just ain't on it. Yeah, he just ain't on it. That's hard. He got old videos. Oh, yeah, of course, of course. Oh, yeah, hey, yeah. Man, if, if Mo3, what do you think he would say We're looking down at you now? Like, I didn't, I didn't got way nicer. Oh, yeah. Flow, you know, for, he, I can always rap, but now, like, if you check them all out, man, I'll be, I'll be talking about something. Man, what I'll was the process of this? Uh, uh, like, like that day when y'all was doing nine times ten feet. Like, what was the, what was the main thing you remember about doing that video with with Mo three? Man, just how hype he had me. Like, I still got pieces on my Instagram. You know, y'all check me out. Just some little dude, but yeah, like how crunky he had me, how turned up he had me. You know, I was really nervous a little bit too, but he had me feeling good. Just having me up. Yeah, damn. It's a party. Where was y'all at? Y'all was y'all like y'all was everywhere. Yeah, hell yeah. The main part though, somewhere with the nine times ten was somewhere in Oak Cliff though. I don't know. You know, I don't really know too much about that side. Yeah. Yeah, hell yeah. Thank. Uh, yeah, I don't know. But what? And but Jeff there, how was it working with him? He was hot at the time. Yeah, I think he, he kind of pushed away from it. Yeah, yeah more, he because that like I'm telling you, this is what I'm saying when it all happened. That too. That's about the same time. I think that's why. Right there. It's cause you. That's why you you blame that on the fact that that's why you push back a little bit. Nah, I ain't push back. I'm just saying. Well, I probably stopped dropping, but Jeff pushed back. Yeah. I just stopped dropping because you know we're going down. Here. I'm not knowing if this really finna work. You know, but yeah. I'm still right there though. Yeah. But that's probably why him and Jeff stopped doing it. You know, cause saying, yeah, he would get it would get that, intense because that shit that happened happened like right when we did after that video. Like it happened at the same time. Like now that you say it, that's probably why he never stopped using Jeff. Like now did you make me think about that? Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jeff probably stopped coming around. They didn't want him, you know. He wanna be in the midst of they it. He probably wanna be in the mix of that. Wow. And you say that like hey, I know him too. Wow. What 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 about um you know it? Like what was the what what was the temperature like when y'all was doing that one? Oh shit, I like, was just like how was y'all how what was the whole problem? Like y'all was in a little house, where was they all at? Oh, and then you know it video? No, yeah. it's just that's just uh, No, no, it, yeah, that's okay. just to do a little old, just to touch the song. Yeah. But that it, it, yeah, it was a video too, though. Yeah, but I'm saying, oh, uh, he wasn't in there when they probably used the clip while he was in the house. Or something. Oh yeah, they did. Unless they took something out. Yeah, there. yeah, hell yeah. But I was in the north though. But when I first recorded, it, if you mean like, I was doing another song and then I just started making sound like, come on, wow. hop on that bitch. Like every time I do that, he hop on that bitch. He always because it's your people. <laughs> yeah, he hop on that bitch. He gonna always rock yeah. with you. I just wasn't taking it serious. I knew he could make it. I ain't know if I could though. Yeah. yeah, but now I you got to take the baton. Than you got to yeah. take the baton now. Yeah. You ain't got no other choice. Yeah, is it? And that's the good thing about he, it, man. He got him. Like, talent like that, you got to make it, you know? Give me your top I three. I wasn't as hard as I am now, too. Oh, for sure. Over time, you're going to get better. Yeah. What's your, what's your top three artists of all time, dead or alive? Number one. Three. Number two. <laughs> um, um, Nipsey. Nipsey, number three. Gucci. Mm. Ooh, that's a hard three. Ooh, Ooh, that go out with bees, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. That I just was, man. I was just getting on uh, rain, man. We be thinking different, man, about man, different stuff. That's what make the show good, you know. What yeah, that? yeah, 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 for sure. <laughs> so, um, if you wasn't here, somebody had to do a documentary about you. Yeah, what would you want them to say? HSM. That you rep H S M to the most fullest. Yeah, you hear me? We're gonna get that money. You know, tell the real and you know what's going on and how big bigger hearts we got. Make sure you say that. Wow. You know. Man. One thing about it, man, two things for show, sure, man. I appreciate you for coming on the show. Square business. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate you. How y'all. can people get a hold of you if they're trying to reach out? Man, Instagram is HSM underscore Ladue L A D U D E. Shit. And my Facebook, HSM Dooski, but, you know, follow me on IG, HSM underscore L-A-D-U-D-E, for sure. That's hard, man. Say, man, I thank you. Like I said, man, I'm going to keep you in my prayers, man. I always put God first, okay? For sure.
Appreciate man, you. love you, bro. Love you too, bro. Anytime yeah. you can call me, I'm gonna give you my number, my whatever, nigga. It, 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 your boy Cole got it calls me when yeah. he want to, but he know I'm gonna talk that real. Yeah, he ain't gonna call me too much. He got, it's gonna <laughs> be real, man. right, baby? It's gonna yeah, be some man. real, real conversation. Ask him. He gonna yeah. answer that nigga gonna talk a real conversation. Yeah. Correct, Check man. it, man. Hey, man. Listen, man. It's been another great segment of Boss Talk One Hundred and One. What a boss is talk. And we out. Yeah, man.